Hey everyone, Joel Hans here, and today I'm outside. Noah's Smokehouse, that's right guys, Noah's Smokehouse in Dearborn, Michigan. So here we are to do a delicious, big, huge, massive barbecue challenge. Yes, that's right. So this platter, this barbecue platter is gonna consist of, I think it's like a pound and a half of brisket. Um, we have some lamb. Yes, they do lamb here. It is a halal restaurant, uh, which is pretty cool. So instead of pork, they do a smoked lamb, which is super sweet. So we got like maybe a half pound of lamb or serving a lamb. We have a huge, huge, huge rack of ribs. That's right, guys. We're talking a full rack of ribs. I think it's like six pounds. There's so many sides like coleslaw and beans and cornbread. There's so much stuff. Uh, I know we are going to have 45 minutes to complete this challenge. I heard it weighs upwards of 10 or 10 plus pounds. So I'll get you some more details. Let's head on in. Should be a lot of fun. Uh, best barbecue and one of the few really legit kind of Texas style, southern style, real homegrown barbecue places in the area. So good barbecue in Michigan. No smokehouse. Let's go eat some food. Everyone, so here we are with the challenge. Absolutely giant. So here we have a full rack of beef ribs. This thing weighs like five to six pounds in itself. We have a pound and a half of brisket. I have about a half a pound of their lamb. Yes, they actually smoke lamb here, which is very unique. We also have three of their house sausages, which are jalapeno sausages. I have a side of beans, a side of coleslaw, a side of the daily vegetable, which is corn. I also have a Noah burger and a rodeo burger, which looks very, very delicious. I have a thing of cornbread, I have half a chicken, and I have a full serving of their smoked wings with a barbecue sauce on them. This is so much food. This is gonna be absolutely insane, but it looks delicious, it smells delicious. I'm so ready for this. Barbecue is my favorite food. So ultimately, let's get started here just momentarily. How to run, so I'm ready. Restaurant's ready. Got our official timer. So how about we get started? We'll say the count of, where do we start? I don't even know where to start. Maybe I'll start with some brisket. One of my favorites. Oh, look at that. That looks delicious. I was in count of five, four, three, two, one. Let's go. Oh, oh my god. That is too good. Oh my god. Alright, I'm gonna have to come back to that because I will just stop right now if I stick on that. Try some of the lamb. Hey everyone, welcome to this video where today we're here at Noah's Smokehouse in Dearborn, Michigan. Yes, that's right, Dearborn. Here, doing some delicious, what is pretty much like a Texas style barbecue, being that it's simple, salt, pepper. You know, a little bit of maybe a little bit of seasons, but pretty straightforward. Just focusing on the meats, just focusing on the wood, and it really brings out the quality and focus on the quality of the meats themselves. That was your spicy sauce. It's good. Definitely a bit of kick to it. There's a barbecue chicken. Very good. So as this is a halal restaurant, they don't serve pork. So we have a full rack of beef ribs, we have a big huge half chicken, we have the different burgers, um, we have the cornbread, we have sausage, we have brisket, we have the corn, the coleslaw, the beans, all very, very delicious looking items. Of course, I'm diving into that chicken and it was very juicy, very, very moist. Um, also as well, I didn't really expect to get, you know, really good barbecue in kind of the Detroit, Michigan area, but in fact you can, which I was super impressed with and I was hoping to get to try everything. Yeah, that chicken's awesome. They put a bit of sauce on it as well. Tastes absolutely delicious. Very juicy chicken. The restaurant itself was also super cool. It's kind of like a Texas theme, really kind of Southern looking. They got wood, they got brick. It's a, definitely a very nice looking spot. I think it's very suiting to have the I Eat Animal shirt on. And the hat. Because I do, I eat animals. So if we were to be able to complete the challenge in the 45 minute time limit, we were gonna get the meal for free. Um, I believe the value is somewhere, I wanna say around 120, maybe $140, maybe 120, something like there. Um, I mean, you definitely, I mean, that was a full, full, full beef, rack of beef ribs, yeah. Now that I think of it, probably more like 140, maybe, yeah, something like that. Um, but very, very delicious food. I mean, we had no shortage of uh, smoked meats. Got some of the other sauces as well. This is the Carolina sauce. Mm. 
That is fantastic. And in all reality, this platter would probably normally feed like eight people, maybe even ten. I mean, there's just absolutely no shortage of food in front of us. Yeah, everything in so far has just been delicious. Sausage is a little bit of a kick, it is a jalapeno sausage. When I referred to Texas style barbecue earlier, you might not be familiar, so let me really briefly explain. So depending on your barbecue style, kind of depends how you dress and cook the meat. So this kind of Texas style or Texas style barbecue generally refers to very little seasonings, such simple ones like salt and pepper, and then just focusing a lot on a heavier smoke flavor and really focus on the flavors of the meat. If you go somewhere like Memphis, um, a lot of them are, uh, they're, you know, they're known for their sticky sauces. So they're not only just kind of cooking the ribs, they're really focusing on the sauces and cooking them with the sauces. Oh my gosh, you guys see how tender that rib was? I can't wait to try this rib too, so. Words can't describe. Oh my god. Woo! Other barbecue regions like the Carolinas are kind of known for their like vinegar sauces, sometimes mustard sauces, depending on where you are. Um, you know, different, uh, like I said, different hubs kind of cook barbecue a little bit differently, and hence kind of a different focus, different style. Anyway, at that, that's pretty much all the info I have for you today. This is definitely my favorite style, um, but everything to this point was tasting absolutely delicious. The brisket was great, the sausage was great, the chicken was great, um, and at that, I hope I get to try everything else. Let's all ultimately tune on in, see what we can do, and uh, at that. Let's see what happens. It's about five minutes in. Everything tastes so damn good. I love everything. I am just in bliss. I just can't stop. It's too good. And we're coming on about eight minutes in. Try one of these wings. Absolutely delicious. They smoke them and they fry them, so they got a little bit crispy. They really have that nice flavor. Nice thing about barbecue, sticky fingers and use your hands are allowed. How's it going, Joe? You rocking? Too. <laughs> Too good. Thank you. That freaking brisket. I appreciate it. The freaking beef ribs. Thank you. You're doing your damage, man. Yeah, I got I haven't tried the burgers yet. This is your favorite. You gotta try them. At least a bite each. Totally in for a treat, man. That's all fire. Thanks, bro. Appreciate Thank it. You. Enjoy, man. Of course, they have the fatty brisket, my favorite. This is the no 
Joe's Burger. We'll give that a try. Very nice. Brisco and everything. an egg on burger person. If you like eggs on burgers, comment below. so far. I'm thoroughly loving it. Just keep on going. It's a lot of food, but man, good food goes down so easy. And I eat animals, so let's keep going. That's crazy. About 20 minutes in. It was crazy just how soft and tender these ribs are. Look just falling off the bone. So delectable. Very rich. Very, very rich. Thoroughly enjoying it. There's a little bit of silver skin on it, which I can't really eat. But very delicious. Very, very much. Is officially done. Now we're just down to the sides. So, start with some beans. These look very delicious, very thick, look delectable. A little sweet, a little spicy, a little zesty. Everything got a little kick to it.
Coleslaw. I should have ate some of this with the ribs. Beautifully crisp. Really nice way to kind of cut some of that richness of those meats. Last but not least, we have cornbread. Woo! No shortage of food. Thank you. And that's a big cornbread. That's a whole muffin. Very delicious though. Let's go, let's fight! Thank you. Alright. I'm just gonna try to shovel these crumbs into my mouth. This seems like a good idea on paper. Let's see if it really is. It could have been worse. All right, let's get some of the shrapnel, and then I think we are officially done. seconds. Man, this thing was so damn good. I can't say enough. Those beef ribs are phenomenal. That brisket is phenomenal. Beef is my favorite. You guys know that. I'm literally eating a cow on my shirt and I'm so glad I was able to actually replicate that. But yeah, seriously, so delicious. Those wings were fantastic. I just can't say enough. Everything was bomb. So everyone, huge thanks to Noah's Smokehouse for having us out here. If you're ever in the Dearborn area, definitely stop on by. Uh, this place is known for its food and it is very delicious. Can't say enough. So huge thanks to staff. Huge thanks to everybody who came out as well. We had lots of people here today, so really appreciate that. And now that's pretty much it. So we're gonna be up for free. It's awesome and uh, I love it. Heavenly bliss. Lots of good food. So if you're in the area, stop on by. And uh, even if you're not in the area, come stop on by. So until next time, everybody. Happy eating. Hope you enjoyed it. And uh, that's about it. Just have a lovely day. And Eat barbecue, eat animals, eat meats.
Dang now the cat, you're gonna be down the menu next week if you don't shut up. So there, everybody, thanks so much for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed. Click my face right here to subscribe. And also, I picked two videos. That's right, two videos just for you that you might like. Right here. So like I said, guys, hit that subscribe. Hit one of these videos. Do it right now. Until next time, have a lovely day.